we want to work efficiently in our projects but there are errors in autocad for example proxy up have you ever faced this this is an error that happens when we received a drawing that wasn't created originally inside the regular autocad program it might be created in autocad architecture autocad civil 3d or any other 3d or 2d program now you're trying to open it here in autocad and that's where this proxy error happens that means we need to constantly keep our drawings nice and clean also you will encounter another error or another problem in this case the ribbon expanding to something like this which is very annoying so basically when this happens is because you have hundreds of textiles in your current drawing so when you edit a text then AutoCAD is trying to expand to fit all of those different textiles over here and the main reason is because we're not keeping our drawing clean so i have the solution for those problems hi there welcome to another lazy show the solution that i'm presenting is a command a tool a macro that i created the lazy perch command if we try to use a regular perch most of the time this won't fix the proxy errors the dozens of textiles in your drawing so i'm gonna utilize the tool palette if you don't see it you can open it with the control 3 on your keyboard and once we have it open I'm gonna right click and say create new palette to start nice and clean so you don't get confused what I'm gonna do next is add anything to my tool palette I'm gonna really quick draw a rectangle and I'm gonna drag that to my tool palette like so once I do that I can edit this by right clicking on it and simply click properties over here we have this tool properties where we can start adding or creating our command macro string over here but for some reason this always starts lock so the way to unlock this is change the use flyout from just to no and that way we can access our command string over here so since i already created this macro command i'm gonna simply go to my patreon post page where i post this because again if you already know me here in the lazy architecture we don't like to waste time so what i'm gonna do is simply go over here and find that command and quickly copy that and then go back to my two properties and simply go ahead and erase this or simply paste my new code so a quick explanation of this tool or macro command is that we're gonna use a command called export to autocad so this is a very handy command that we can use again to clean our drawing so that way we can avoid any errors so we're following the prompts here and then we're adding a, a phrase here this phrase you can change it or customize it per your needs but i simply gonna say clean and fixed and then what we're gonna do is save our drawing and then immediately close our so once we have that code of course you can rename your command as you wish but i'm gonna call it lazy perch and this command you can add a description this command cleans your drawings and so on and of course we can assign an image or an icon if we want by right clicking on it and saying a specify image you can browse your computer and find an image an icon you can download it from the internet if you want i'm not gonna do that right now because that's not important at this moment but let's click and once we have that let's go over here right our command is right here the lazy perch command and it's time for us to test it so in order to test this what i'm gonna do is go and open the folder where this drawing is so as you can see the size is more than a thousand kbs which and that's huge for a regular autocad drawing it's about you know 500 to 700 even 800 kb but this is double so that's huge so let's uh, quickly utilize or test our new lazy perch command to clean up this drawing and let's see if it Work. so let me go over here and test it let's click on it lace perch and boom so what it did is it closed your drawing and once we open our folder we're gonna have this brand new drawing called clean and fix so what we can do now is simply erase the original drawing which was huge you can see the size difference and go ahead and rename our fixed or clean drawing so that way when we open it 
it's nice and clean and we don't have any errors at all what do you think about this lazy purge command hopefully you can implement this command in your workflow and to avoid many different errors in AutoCAD